To combat illicit narcotics in the region, the EU-funded project CCOP v and the Ministry of Home Affairs signed a Memorandum of Understanding today at the Guyana Coast Guard Training Facility in Kingston to pursue cooperation in the battle against illicit marine commerce. Dominique Borkas, the CCOP team leader, gave an overview of the project. Our partnership with Guyana uh, is growing a lot uh, as we have already held a national steering committee and today we are uh, together to sign uh, the Memorandum of Understanding. A second reason why um, Guyana is, uh, is particularly important for the, for the project and, and for the European Union is that Guyana is a key country for traffickers. But at the same time, the law enforcement tools are very relevant and uh, we used to work a lot with uh, Kenny, for instance. This uh, combination of a real threat regarding trafficking, but at the same time with a strong response, push to a particular attention for CCOP project. The event marks a long-standing collaboration between the two parties in the fight against drug trafficking in the region. The fight against illicit maritime trade and associated criminal networks is ongoing in targeted countries in the Caribbean, including Guyana, Latin, Latin America, and West Africa. Consistent with human rights, the project seeks to help alleviate illicit trafficking, negative impact on security, public health, and socio-economic development. The head of the Kano administration, Mr. James Singh, spoke of the partnership with other agencies that have helped find persons to who use illicit drugs. We share, do joint operations. It builds a level of trust. At the end of the day, we are working against transnational crime. So I would like to thank the European Union for continuing that program and uh, Dominic for his and his team uh, from Jamaica as well as uh, expertise France. I would also like to thank the Ministry for the continued support. What you see in this room here is a result of Guyana's efforts to combat transnational crime, whether it's narcotics, whether it's illegal unregulated fishing, whether it's arms trafficking or even migrant smuggling. Minister of Home Affairs Rosen Ben also gave his remarks at the event. The government of Guyana, through its Ministry of Home Affairs, is resolute in its fight against global threats, organized trap, crime, and on the question of maritime security. Given Guyana's recent developments in, oil and in the oil and gas sector, the country will likely see a rise in these threats. We must therefore be better equipped and prepare to combat and mitigate these threats and the consequences of these threats. Signing this memorandum of understanding will reinforce the effectiveness of the CCOP Maritime Intelligence and Maritime River Control Network geographically and technically, and particularly enhance Guyana's capability in relation to the transatlantic effort against the trafficking in illegal narcotics and other uh, goods. In attendance was the EU ambassador, Fernando's Pons. For Channel 2 Headline News, Esther Sobers.